In this video, we will see how to edit the features on Google Map on Apple CarPlay. So if you want to reach the settings, what you want to do is to hit the map and then reach the gear menu over here. And we only have six features. So there is the route option. So on here, you can select if you want to have or avoid something. So for example, tolls, highways, and ferries. So you just select it. And yeah, it's annoying, but every time you select something, it goes out. So if you want to disable everything, you need to go back in the settings and re-disable it. That's the way it is. Then you got the map colors. So you've got automatic. So this will change between day and night, or you can have night mode that will be dark like this one. And the light, the day mode is the same as this one on automatic mode, because actually, as you can see, it is day outside. Then <laughs> uh, if you reach again, the gear menu, you've got the satellite map. If you enable this, you will have, well, the satellite image, but that may take some data on your phone plan. If that's important to you, disable it. That may do a lot. Uh, you've got the traffic here that you can enable or disable. So yeah, it's the, the traffic that will be broadcast on the map. And you've got the north up feature over here that will take the map this way. So instead of looking forward uh, all the time on the map, it will set the north up and this arrow will represent where you are looking at. So actually, as you can see, I am pointing to the east. And if I go disable it, well, you see, I'm looking into that direction and probably you can't see it, but yes, there is the lake over there and the lake is, is, is there, as you can see. And finally, the last option is the volume. Uh, when you press it, you can change navigation volume with your car's controls, but only when navigation is speaking. As you can see, you can change the volume, you can change navigation volume with just your car's controls, like that while it's navigation. speaking to adjust it to the way you want and then hit cancel and then you're done. So that was the Google map settings on Apple CarPlay. I hope this was helpful.